Now this is the original paint job uh, that we put on it. And this is the side, uh, we keep it in kind of a carport. And so this is the side that does not face the sun. The other side, is faded as you can see unfortunately um, but uh, there's options for painting these things you know you can get them painted for about anywhere from two to five thousand dollars depending on what you want to do uh, I painted this one with some it's, there's a local paint manufacturer uh, that I kind of took their advice and probably shouldn't have most people will paint them with tractor paint uh, and it holds up really well and so then you can paint it yourself like I did this one um, you can paint them for oh you know anywhere from two to five hundred dollars depending on what paint you choose. But this one, the paint has stayed on really well. Um, the only areas that were an issue is right up here at the top. There was on the side that's in the sun. The other side it was not a problem at all. But along there, where the gutter runs right along the top, um, that gutter is one piece. So when it gets hot, it stretches quite a bit. And so it tore the paint um, across the top up there and made it chip just a little bit. So what I would do next time is when I got through painting it, I'd come back with a razor blade and slick that paint uh, so that it wouldn't be pulling against itself. But other than that, uh, this, you know, this would just take a light sanding and it'd be ready to uh, spray another, another coat of paint on. All right, so I hope these videos have been helpful to you. I hope it inspires you, gives you some ideas um, of how to uh, do some things. I didn't go into great detail about how things are made. Um, that would have been a really, really long videos and a lot of time uh, that probably nobody would have ever listened to or watched. So you may still have a lot of questions. Really just look at this as it was just <clears throat> in order to give people ideas um, if they're trying to convert their own bus or maybe just for entertainment. But just kind of give you an idea of things you can do uh, to uh, make a bus that you would enjoy. Well, I hope this series was interesting to you. And if you're interested in buying this bus, let me know. Thank you for watching.